Hello, everyone. I am Evan Bishop, principal at the high school. And on behalf of the entire faculty and staff, I want to welcome you all to our virtual senior recognition night for the class of 2021. Now, recognition night is an opportunity for us to honor the many outstanding contributions of our graduating seniors in the classroom and in service to their school and community. In addition, we will award almost $200,000 in scholarship money to deserving students tonight which is just incredible given the circumstances. I wanna thank the many sponsors and local organizations for their continued support, even through these incredibly challenging times. We greatly appreciate it. I'd also like to take a minute to thank our amazing front office staff, particularly Connie O'Laughlin and Kayla Sables, our entire counseling staff, and John Padula, our technology integration specialist for their hard work and efforts in helping to plan organize and put together tonight's event. They do such an amazing job behind the scenes and I cannot thank them enough. I'd also like to take this opportunity to thank all the parents of the class of 2021 who have helped and volunteered their time, not only throughout their child's tenure at the high school, but throughout their time in the district. There is always a core group of parents ready to step up and lend a hand when needed. Your commitment and support of our school and this group of students has been so much appreciated over the last four years. Again, tonight is truly a chance to honor, to acknowledge, and to be proud. Although the class of 2021 will soon leave us, their contributions recognized tonight will be part of their legacy at HHS for many years to come. Now, I'd like to introduce Charlie Nealon, Student Council President, to welcome you all here this evening. Good evening, everyone. My name is Charlie Nealon, and this year, I had the honor of being Student Council President. This year, was obviously like no other and challenged us as a school and a community. Without the hard work and dedication of our staff, faculty, administration, and school committee, we would not be where we are right now. Their countless plans and impulsive decisions allowed us to keep ourselves and our peers safe while keeping in mind the importance of a school environment. I would like to say thank you to all the people who have helped with this year, from ending a school year all remote and starting another year in hybrid, the school smoothly transitioned into a comfort level with the times we were living in. To our custodial staff and the others who dedicated their time to setting up our school, to follow safety precautions and preparing for return, thank you. It's a crazy world we're living in, but this year cannot have happened without you or anyone else. As a grade, the class of 2021 have learned how to ultimately persevere this year. Four years ago, we walked into HHS as fresh babe for the other classes. We didn't know where the ceiling was, which sterile was the fastest, or what lunches our classes had, even though that was still a struggle for some of us this year. Looking back, we have grown as a grade. We have welcomed many new students and built relationships with many people that we will carry on after we leave here. Though we may not see a lot of each other ever again once we leave, we can take these in the next couple of days and months to say goodbye to one another. One thing I have noticed with our grade and I'm sure others, especially faculty have as well, is that when there's a chance to do something, we usually do it. Yes, there may have been consequences with those choices, but those risks did not stop us. From sending messages on our beloved class group me to pushing for many senior events this year, we took those chances. We may have faced some obstacles in the way, but we overcame them. Tonight is a night where we can come together as a grade and honor the accomplishments of our peers. We can root for the achievements of the dedication that the class of 2021 has put into their work and community. Although some may not receive an award or a scholarship, that will not let anyone's hard work be overshadowed. Tonight we can support one another and recognize what our grade is made of, and most importantly, who our grade is made of. Our grade is like no other, and it's made of so many amazing people that we will be there for them like they'll be there for us. Hoppington High School has been great to us and we have been great to HHS. This year has been memorable for many different reasons. I hope that when we look back at our high school experience, we are proud of our grade. In the future, we will appreciate who we were and who we have become. A key aspect will be the ability to persevere. Life will throw tragedies in our way, but I'm sure that the class of 2021 will defeat those challenges and strive. We all have different plans as we leave here, but no matter what, we will always be the class of 2021 and will always be a part of each other's lives in one way. Thank you and congratulations to the class of 2021.
It is my pleasure to give out this year's Principal Award. There are two moments each year above all else that I look forward to most. The first will be watching the seniors cross the stage at graduation tomorrow night. And the second is being able to present this award to a member of the senior class this evening. Now, selecting only one student for this award has been very difficult for me. There are so many deserving students in this class, but there is one in particular to me that exemplifies what this award represents, which is leadership, a positive attitude and outlook, and above all else, an individual who will be an outstanding ambassador for HHS in the years to come. Now, before I list the many accomplishments, I think it's important to mention there is far more to this student than an impressive resume. It's often tough to measure the little things that make him, in my opinion, so special. For example, this student moved to the United States from Iran in ninth grade knowing very little English and is now fluent and can write and speak beautifully. For the last four years, he has created multiple successful businesses and uses his motivation and innovation as constant inspiration for new ideas. Beyond his own personal projects, he has also been a standout member of our Business Professionals of America team. I got to know this student well on a BPA trip we took together to Anaheim, California during his sophomore year. It was then that I realized just how special he was. He has gone on to win local, regional, national, and international awards for his ideas and presentations in the areas of coding and entrepreneurship and has such a bright future ahead in those fields. In addition, there is never a day that goes by that I see him without a smile on his face. This student is extremely considerate and has one of the best temperaments I have seen in a high school student. He has established himself as a vital member of our school community. He is genuine, caring, poised, articulate, kind, and has truly left his mark and will be missed next fall. It is my privilege to give this year's Principal Award to Mahdi Maimandi Nahad. Greetings, faculty, families, friends, and most importantly, graduates in the class of 2021. Each year, the guidance department and the high school principal recommend an exceptional student for the superintendent's award. The criteria include academic distinction, outstanding character, leadership, and service to school. This year's recipient, according to her guidance counselor, possesses a relentless nature and her resume supports that assertion. When only a sophomore, this young woman took on Advanced Placement Calculus AB, and in her time at Hopkinton High School, she would go on to enroll in and ace a total of 12 AP classes. A gifted violinist, this young woman earned a place in the Massachusetts Music Educators District Orchestra for four years running and in the Allstate Orchestra three times. She also plays in the Boston Youth Symphony Orchestra. In addition to her success in music, the student independently studied oil painting and earned a scholastic silver key. This year's recipient is a National Merit Scholar finalist and the 2021 valedictorian. She will head to the University of Michigan in the fall to study biomedical engineering. It is my distinct pleasure to present the 2021 Superintendent's Award to Andrea Liu. Thank you. Congratulations, Andrea. Back in the spring of 2014, the Bedford family started a memorial fund in Abby Bedford's memory to increase awareness of food allergies, to drive research to solve the public health epidemic that food allergies have become, and to fund scholarships for Hopkinton High School students. The Keep Smiling Award is voted on by the teachers at HHS as a career achievement award to two graduating seniors who have demonstrated the character traits that Abby brought to Hopkinton High School, such as being thoughtful, empathetic, a great friend, having strong school and community spirit, and having a great sense of humor. The award includes recognition here tonight and is accompanied by a $2,500 scholarship to aid in the recipient's post-secondary education. Now this year's winners could not be more appropriate for this award. They are two very talented, happy, positive students that in my opinion, have changed the culture at HHS 
for the better during their four years. Please join me in congratulating the two very deserving recipients of the 2021 Keep Smiling Award, Chloe Johnson and Courtney Olofsson. The network of enterprising women, known as NEW, was formed in 2008 in Hopkinton for and by female business professionals from the Metro West area. The goal of NEW was to provide business support, education, and marketing opportunities, and to help facilitate both personal and professional growth for its members. As a nonprofit organization, they have helped donate money and goods to Project Just Because during their existence. They have sadly disbanded the organization, but hope in the future that a bright and accomplished young woman, such as this recipient, will continue the mission. I am very pleased to give this award on behalf of NEW to Sienna Harrigan. The next specialty award is an award that we started in honor of what everyone has been through over the last 15 months. We call this award the 2020 Award. The award will go to one student in the graduating class that exemplifies the qualities such as being resilient, passionate, generous, well-rounded, having that Hiller spirit, and above all else, inclusive. The winner of this award will receive $500 to put toward their post-secondary plans. It is my pleasure to announce the winner of this year's 2020 award, Isabella Ridelli. Varsity Movers was started by HHS 2019 grad Kieran Herr during his junior year in high school. The company tagline is student athletes tackling the jobs that are too small for moving companies, but too big for you. Not only does the company help families in Metro West with their smaller moving needs, it also employs HHS student athletes who often have a hard time finding a job due to busy school and practicing game time constraints. Over the past three years, they've helped with almost 1,000 moves and have employed 20 students. Giving back has always been a pillar of the business. And this year, Varsity Movers is excited to be offering its first ever HHS scholarship. They were seeking students who had started a business, started a club, or were interested in entrepreneurship in the future. Each student who applied had impressive tales to tell, but one stood out as she overcame obstacles and built a bakery business, which helped her learn a lot about herself. We are proud to award the first Varsity Movers Scholarship to Valeria Azofifa. And wish her much luck in future endeavors. Nia Alvarado Rodriguez is awarded with the Canty Underdog Scholarship the Hoppington Teachers Association Scholarship, and the Navigator Achievement Award. <laughs> Nicholas Alvarado Rodriguez has been selected for the Lauren Anderson Memorial Scholarship and the Navigator Achievement Award. <laughs> Daniel Andrews is receiving the Hoppington High School Renaissance Scholarship, MSAA's Principal's Recognition Award, and the Peer Leader Award. Jessica Applebaum is honored with the Navigator Achievement Award. And Delaney Augsburg is receiving the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in Spanish. Kendall August is recognized for the National Association of Music Education Tri-M Music National Honor Society and the Coplic Certificate of Mastery with Distinction. Valeria Azofefa is awarded the Varsity Movers Entrepreneurial Scholarship and the Navigator Achievement Award. <laughs> Lily Bowery has been selected for the Hoppington Teachers Association Scholarship and the Science Department Award for Physics. <laughs> Catherine Berry is receiving the Hoppington Women's Club Mary McDonough Service Award and the Sharon Timlin Memorial Scholarship. Amelia Bashi qualified for 
BPA's Nationals. Elise Blackstock qualified for BPA's Nationals. Caden Boyce is honored with the Hoppenden Marathon Fund Scholarship. Nicholas Brown is recognized for the Foreign Language Department Award for French Five and the Hopkinton High School Scholar Athlete Award. <laughs> Julia Budden is awarded with the Hopkinton Teachers Association Scholarship, the National Association of Music Education Tri and National Honor Society, the Foreign Language Department Award for AP Spanish, the Massachusetts Seal of Biodiversity with Distinction in Spanish, and the National Merit Scholarship as a committed student. <laughs> Holly Burns has been selected for the Canty Underdog Scholarship and HPTO's Spirit of Volunteerism Scholarship. <laughs> Shay Butler is recognized for the National Merit Scholarship as a committed student and the Teachers of Psychology in Secondary Schools Award. Mia Carboni is receiving a Scholastic Writing Award, the Honorable Mention Distinction for a Personal Essay or Memoir. She's also receiving two other Scholastic Writing Awards in the form of Silver Keys for her poetry and critical essay submissions. Mia has received our English Department Award in the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy with distinction in Spanish. <laughs> Abigail Cassidy is honored with the Framingham Rotary Education Fund Scholarship, the Hoppington Booster Scholarship, the Hoppington Farmers Market Scholarship, the Catholic Certificate of Mastery with Distinction, and the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in French. <laughs> Ethan Champlin has been selected as the Hiller Student Athlete of the Year. Jake Chirko is awarded the Middlesex Savings Bank Scholarship, the Pay It Forward Andy Wessel Memorial Scholarship, the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in Spanish, and the Copic Certificate of Mastery with Distinction. <laughs> Natalie Clot is recognized for the Teachers of Psychology in Secondary Schools Award. Ross Komkowicz has been selected for the St. Matthew's Church Mary Aikens in the Murphy Family Scholarship. <laughs> Caroline Connell is receiving the Mary Corby Memorial Scholarship, the Hoppington Basketball Association Scholarship, the Hoppington Marathon Fund Scholarship, and the St. Matthew's Church Mary Aikens in the Murphy Family Scholarship. <laughs> Matthew Cooper is honored with the Foreign Language Department Award for Spanish Five and the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy, also in Spanish. <laughs> Jay Katyan qualified for the International Vex World Championship. <laughs> Esther Klinger is awarded with the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in Spanish. Matthew Klinger is receiving the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in Spanish. <laughs> Congratulations and good luck to all the class of 2021 graduates. You will surely be missed. Francis D'Urso, Hawkenden Teachers Association Scholarship. Kushi Dave. Hopkinton High School Renaissance Scholarship. Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy, French. <laughs> Haley DeLuca, Canty's Underdog Scholarship. <laughs> Caitlin Dion, Canty's Underdog Scholarship, National Association of Music Education Tri M Music National Honor Society, and National Merit Scholarship Commended Student. 
Andrew Domingo, Massachusetts Sealed by Literacy in Spanish. David Denoyan, HCAM Broadcasting and Communication Scholarship, Hopkins and Teachers Association Scholarship. Aditya Duda, Hopkins and Women's Club Scholarship, Hopkins and Marathon Fund Scholarship, Hopkins and High School Student Council Scholarship, Korean Presbyterian Church Scholarship, National Association of Music Education Tri M Music National Honor Society, and Hopkins and High School Scholar Athlete Award. Faria Fardine, Science Fair Research Award Participation, and Massachusetts Sealed by Literacy in Spanish. <laughs> Greta Field, Mary Corby UMass Scholarship. <laughs> Alexander Foman, Hopkins and Women's Club Scholarship, National Merit Scholarship Semifinalist, Music Department Award for Chorus, and Massachusetts Sealed by Literacy with Distinction in Russia. Nathan Foster, Business, Technology and Engineering, Department Senior Award, Qualified for International VEX Robotics World Championship, and Complex Certificate of Mastery with Distinction. <laughs> Jessica Franks, Hopkins and Teachers Association Educator Award Scholarship, Hopkins and Moms Group Scholarship, and Music Department Award for Band. <laughs> Devin Gross, John and Helen O'Brien Memorial Scholarship, and William B. Hosmer Memorial Scholarship. <laughs> Rehan Habib, National Merit Scholarship, Commended Student. Iman Hader, qualified for International VEX Robotics World Championship. <laughs> Emily Hackinson, Hopkins and Teachers Association Scholarship. <laughs> Emma Hansen, Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in Spanish. <laughs> Kylie Hardenbrook, Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in Spanish. Leela Hardin, Qualified for Business Professionals Association Nationals. Sienna Harrigan, Network of Enterprising Women Scholarship, President's Volunteer Service Award, Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in French. Parker Home, Hopkins and High School Renaissance Scholarship. Helena Hubie is awarded the Navigator Achievement Award. Nick Agartuga has been selected for the Hopton Women's Club Scholarship, the Canties Underdog Scholarship, the Hopkinton Teachers Association Scholarship, the Marine Corps Foundation Scholarship, and finally, the Navigator Achievement Award. Dimash Jain has qualified for the International VEX World Championship. <laughs> Chloe Johnson is receiving the Lauren Anderson Memorial Scholarship, the Navigator Achievement Award, as well as the Academic Achievement Award. <laughs> Olivia Jones has earned a National Merit University of Florida Scholarship. She has also been chosen for the Science Departmental Award in Physics the Science Fair Research Award for Participation, the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in French, the National Merit Scholarship Finalist, as well as the Hopkins High School Scholar Athlete Award. <laughs> Elizabeth Kane is honored with the Hopkins Music Association Stephen T. Varro Scholarship, as well as the National Association of Music Education Tri-M Music National Honor Society. She has also been chosen by the Music Departmental Award in Chorus, as well as the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in Spanish. And finally, she has been chosen by the Massachusetts State Field Hockey Coaches Association as an Academic All-Star Award. Woo! Woo! 
Nick Capellos has been selected for the Navigator Achievement Award. Aiden Keeley has been recognized for the Hopkins Basketball Association Scholarship Award. Brian Keefe is awarded the Hopkinton Teachers Association Scholarship. Amanda Kelly has been chosen for the Sam Click Memorial Scholarship, as well as a Navigator Achievement Award, and the St. Matthew's Church and Mary Aikens and Murphy Family Scholarship. <laughs> Tara Kester is receiving the Hopkinton Police Association Scholarship. Nagun Kisari has qualified for the International VEX Robotics World Championship, as well as earning the Coplet Certificate of Mastery with distinction. <laughs> Nate Crozy is honored with a Navigator Achievement Award, as well as the Hopkins Youth Commission Outstanding Community Services Award. Paige Lavalon is recognized for the Hopkins Farmers Market Scholarship, as well as the National Association for the Music Education Tri-M Music National Honor Society. <laughs> Andrea Liu has been selected for the Hopkins Music Association John McCarran Scholarship, as well as the Mathematical Department Award for AP Stats, the Science Department Award, the Music Department Award for Band, an All-State Music Festival, Senior District Festival, the National Association of Music Education for the Tri-M Music National Honor Society, the National Merit Scholarship as a semifinalist. She was selected for the United States Air Force for the Math and Science Award. She was also selected for the United States Marine Corps Scholastic Excellence. And finally, She's the class of 2021 valedictorian. Andrew Liu is recognized for the National Merit Scholarship as a commended student. Juliana Lucas has been selected by the teachers of psychology in secondary schools. Congratulations to Alana Miller for earning the Hopkinton Women's Club Scholarship, our Music Department Award in Band, a Science Fair Research Award, and for her induction into the National Association of Music Education Tri-M Music National Honor Society. <laughs> Rohan Minosha is a National Merit Scholarship finalist and has received the National Merit Corporation Scholarship. Dylan Morin is awarded our Drama Department Award in Performing Arts for Acting. <laughs> Catherine Morris is awarded our Candy's Underdog Scholarship. So proud of you, Catherine. Congrats, Elizabeth Mosher. She has been selected for the Hopkinton High School Renaissance Scholarship. Megan Murchie is being recognized with the Hopkinton Women's Club Scholarship, the Canty's Underdog Scholarship, and has earned the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in Spanish. <laughs> Lauren Murphy will be receiving the Jane Walzell Athletic Scholarship, as well as the Hopkinton Basketball Association Scholarship. Congrats, Lulu. <laughs> Nitya Nambiar has qualified for the International VEX Robotics World Championship, Maybe not so surprisingly, but much deserved. She has also earned our Business Technology and Engineering Department's Senior Award. Congrats to Charles Nealon. Charlie is awarded the Hopkinton Women's Club Scholarship, the Canty's Underdog Scholarship, and the Hopkinton High School Student Council Scholarship. Lucas Nealon, responsible for the awesome artwork in the yearbook, is recognized tonight for receiving the Patricia M. Sphinx Art Scholarship and the Hopkinton Women's Club Scholarship. <laughs> Isabella Rourke has received the Hopkinton High School Renaissance Scholarship and has also earned the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in French. One of our Keep Smiling recipients, Courtney Oliston, will also receive the Hopkinton Women's Club Scholarship and the Navigator Achievement Award. <laughs> Our 
proving that hard work pays off. I'm excited to share that Mirabella Pellucci will be receiving the Hopkinton Women's Club Scholarship, the South Asian Circle of Hopkinton Scholarship, Blackstone Valley Wealth Management Scholarship, Hopkinton Marathon Fund Scholarship, and our Hopkinton Teachers Association Scholarship. She is also awarded our Music Department Award for Orchestra, the Copeland Certificate of Mastery with Distinction, and has been inducted into the National Association of Music Education's Tri-M Music National Honor Society. Way to go, Mirabella. Congrats, Abed Pir Mohammed. He has earned the Copeland Certificate of Mastery with Distinction, as well as our Mathematics Department Award for AP Calculus. Congratulations, seniors. Proud of you, excited for you, and miss you already. Congratulations to Adrena Arakalian, who earned the Science Fair Research Award for participation. Congratulations to Sarah Bernardo, who received the HPTO Spirit of Volunteerism Scholarship, the Hopkinton Girls Youth Lacrosse Scholarship, and the Hopkinton Marathon Fund Scholarship. Sarah was also recognized as a National Merit Scholarship Commended Student and honored through the National Hispanic Recognition Program. Congratulations to Kamala Trus, who earned the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in Spanish. Congratulations to Sophie Cowan, who has been a member of the National Association of Music Education Tri-M Music National Honor Society. Congratulations to Riley Delaney, who is being awarded the Hopkinton Women's Club Scholarship. Congratulations to Pablo Diaz Granados, who is recognized as a National Merit Commended Student, a member of the National Hispanic Recognition Program, and who earned the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy with Distinction in Spanish. Congratulations to Karen Gallagher, who earned the Teachers of Psychology and Secondary Schools Award, and who is recognized as a National Merit Commended Student. Congratulations to Andrew Gilbert, who earned the Coplick Certificate of Mastery with Distinction. Congratulations to Katherine Graham for receiving the Canties Underdog Scholarship, the Foreign Language Department Award for Mandarin 4, and the Drama Department Award for Performing Arts and Acting. Congratulations to Thomas Guerra, who earned the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in Spanish. Congratulations to John Mastrangelo, who is being awarded with the Hopkinton Marathon Fund Scholarship. Congratulations to Madi Maimandi Nehad, who qualified for Business Professionals Association Nationals and who earned the Copelic Certificate of Mastery with distinction. Congratulations to Kristen McCluskey, who is receiving the Hopkinton Marathon Fund Scholarship and who is being honored as the Hiller Student Athlete of the Year. Congratulations to Rose McKeon, who is the recipient of the Hopkinton High School Renaissance Scholarship. Congratulations to Aiden Medeiros, who earned the Music Department Louis Armstrong Award and who is a member of the National Association of Music Education Tri-M Music National Honor Society. Congratulations to Matthew Meek, who is being honored with the United States Marine Corps Semper Fidelis Music Award. Congratulations to Tiffany McCulis for earning the following scholarships and awards. The Hopkinton Girls Youth Lacrosse Scholarship, the Hopkinton Farmers Market Scholarship, the Hopkinton Marathon Fund Scholarship, the Hopkinton Teachers Association Scholarship, and the Hopkinton Garden Club Scholarship. Tiffany also earned the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in French and the United States Marine Corps Distinguished Athlete Award. Congratulations to Charlotte Picard, who is being awarded with the Hopkinton High School Renaissance Scholarship. 
Congratulations to Richard Casey Pratt, who earned the Drama Department Award for Technical Theater. Congratulations to Hannah Quinlan, who is being honored with the Foreign Language Department Award for Spanish Five and the Coplic Certificate of Mastery with Distinction. Congratulations to Kelly Title for earning the following scholarships and awards. The HPTO Spirit of Volunteerism Scholarship, the Hockington Farmers Market Scholarship, the Mary Roach Award, the Massachusetts Daughters of the American Revolution Scholarship, the Mathematics Department Award for AP Statistics, the Science Department Award for Physics, and the Science Fair Research Award for Participation. Congratulations to Shreya Salvayapati, who is the recipient of the History and Social Sciences Department Award, the Law Day Good Citizen Award. Shreya also qualified for Business Professionals Association Nationals and was honored as a National Merit Scholarship Commended Student. Congratulations to Angelina Thompson, who is receiving the Hopkinton Teachers Association Scholarship and the Lou and Kathy White Memorial Scholarship. Congratulations to Jeffrey Toko, who is being honored with the Knights of Columbus Bishop Rice Council 4822 Scholarship. Congratulations to Haley Tolson, who is the recipient of the Hopkinton High School Renaissance Scholarship. And congratulations to Isaiah Wute Thomas, who is being honored with the Music Department John Philip Sousa Award, who is a member of the National Association of Music Association Tri-M Music National Honor Society, and who earned the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy with Distinction in Spanish. Gianna Eddy is awarded the Hopkinton Teachers Association Scholarship. Kelsey Eddy has been selected for the Navigator Achievement Award. Isabella Rodelli is receiving the Navigator Achievement Award and the 2020 Award. Mantra Rajkumar is honored with the Foreign Language Department Award for Spanish for the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy for Spanish, the Science Fair Research Award for Participation, the Senior Science Research Award Third Place High School Science Fair, and is a National Merit Scholarship Commended Student. Soleil Randall is recognized by the National Association of Music Education, Tri-M Music National Honor Society. Elena Reagan is awarded the Hopkinton Women's Club Scholarship, the Hopkinton Teachers Association Scholarship, the Navigator Achievement Award, and the Thomas Weaver B Positive Memorial Fund Scholarship. William Rock is awarded the Music Department Award for Band and is recognized by the National Association of Music Education Tri-M Music National Honor Society. Nicholas Rogerson has been selected for the Business Technology Engineering Department Senior Award. Isabel Saparoshitz is recognized for the Science Fair Research Award participation. Ellery Shute is honored with the Hopkinton Women's Club Scholarship, the Hopkinton High School Renaissance Scholarship, the Science Fair Research Award participation, and the Science Department Award for AP Environmental Science. Marley Sensenderfer is receiving the Hopkinton High School Renaissance Scholarship, a Scholastic Writing Award, Honorable Mention for Poetry, the Art Department Award, and the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy for Spanish. 
Amelia Sensony has been selected for the Hopkinton Basketball Association Scholarship. Geneva Skanger is receiving the Hopkinton Women's Club Scholarship and the Hopkinton Teachers Association Scholarship. Teja Shah has qualified for International VEX Robotics World Championship. Ronald Seamus is recognized with the United States Marine Corps Distinguished Athlete Award. Bonnie Sharma has been selected for the Massachusetts State Field Hockey Coaches Association Joanne Paquette Academic All-Star Award. Yusad Sheik is recognized as a National Merit Scholarship Commended Student. Eric Schultz is being awarded a Navigator Achievement Award. Jacob Sokol has been selected for the Linda Karner Memorial Scholarship. <laughs> Alyssa Souza is recognized by the Hopkinton Police Association Scholarship and Hopkinton Organization for Prevention and Metro West Youth teaming together. <laughs> Daniel Steering has been selected for a Navigator Achievement Award. Alisa Stallier is recognized as a National Merit Scholarship Commended Student and is receiving a Science Fair Research Award for participation. <laughs> Maya Storm has been selected for a Hopkinton High School Renaissance Scholarship and is, is receiving the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in Spanish. Sankap Sapendu has qualified for Business Professionals Association Nationals. Shashir Sudaman has qualified for International VEX Robotics World Championship. May Sutherland has been selected for the National Bereshi Service and Leadership Scholarship and has received a Scholastic Writing Award honorable mention for drawing and illustration. <laughs> Catherine Shepankavich is honored with the Candies Underdog Scholarship, the Evan Girardi Memorial Scholarship, Teachers of Psychology in Secondary Schools, the Science Department Award for Anatomy and Physiology, and it is honored by the National Association of Music Education, Tri-M Music National Honor Society. Good evening. Giulio Bardelli has been chosen for the Science Department Award in Physics. Emma Van Beek was selected for the Music Department Award in Orchestra. Lily Vaughn is receiving the Navigator Achievement Award. Alexis Veal is being honored with the William B. Hosmer Memorial Scholarship, the Pay It Forward Andy Wells L. Memorial Scholarship, the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy for Spanish, and the Art Department Award. Heather Villani is chosen for the Scholastic Writing Award, an honorable mention for digital art. Alopa Wage is receiving a Hopkinton Women's Club Scholarship, a Framingham Rotary Education Fund Scholarship, a VHS Scholarship. She received a Science Fair Research Award for participation, and she qualified for the International VEX Robotics World Championship. John Watson is awarded a Hopkinton Booster Scholarship, 
Hopkinton Marathon Fund Scholarship. He's receiving the Foreign Language Department Award for AP Spanish, and he has earned a Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in Spanish. Antonio Wessinger is honored with a Hopkinton High School Drama Scholarship, a Hopkinton Music Association Scholarship, a Hopkinton Poly Arts Scholarship, a Hopkinton Teachers Association Scholarship, a Music Department Award for Co Chorus, the National Association of Music Education Tri-M Music National Honor Society, and he is a National Merit Scholarship Commended Student. Ashley Wojcik is receiving an HPTO Spirit of Volunteerism Scholarship. <laughs> Eliza Worrell is selected for a Hopkinton Teachers Association Scholarship, the Korean Presbyterian Church Scholarship, and a Pay It Forward Andy Wellzell Memorial Scholarship. <laughs> Sri Rupa Yaramsetti is receiving a Hopkinton Teachers Association Scholarship, a Science Fair Research Award for participation, and she's earned the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy in Spanish. <laughs> Michael Yosef has been chosen for the Mary Roach Award, and he is our Class of 2021 Salutatorian. Mohammed Ali Zaidi is receiving a Hopkinton Women's Club Scholarship, the Framingham Rotary Education Fund Scholarship, the Hopkinton Marathon Fund Scholarship. <laughs> Anne Zhu is awarded a National Merit Scholarship Commended Student Award. Uh, she's receiving a Science Fair Research Award for participation, and she's earned the Massachusetts Seal of Biliteracy with distinction in Spanish. <laughs> Congratulations to all these students in the class of 2021. That concludes our award ceremony for this evening. Thank you so much for being with us and tuning in. I can't wait to see everyone in person tomorrow night at 6 p.m. on the football field for our big ceremony. And again, on Saturday at 10 a.m. for the Cobb Parade. Again, thank you so much for joining us and have a nice night.